Hey everybody, Dan here with Pain Free You. Today I wanted to talk about a bigger, broader topic. How to end chronic pain. Now it applies to most of you. And if you don't have pain, whatever symptoms you have, this all applies, right? Because whether you've got pain or non-pain symptoms, the cause and the solution is uh, pretty much the same. So, for anybody new to the channel here, welcome. My name is Dan from Pennsylvania. And uh, 25 years ago or so, um, I started my journey with chronic back pain. That lasted 13 years. And uh, there is a way to end your chronic pain because I've been chronic pain free for the past 14 years. So yes, you can end chronic pain. Chronic just means it's lasted longer than a typical healing from an acute injury would, would uh, take. Um, it doesn't mean it's forever. And if you've done any amount of research, the internet's a kind of scary place because, you know, there's plenty of, uh, plenty of places that will say there's no cure for chronic pain. You can manage it. You might get remission for a while, and it's a whole bunch of dismal, dark, scary stuff on the internet. So, um, how to end chronic pain? Well, number one, first and foremost, it is absolutely possible. And I know that because I've been coaching people to end their own chronic pain for six or seven years now. Um, check out my channel, Pain Free You Channel on YouTube and click on the playlist and look at the success stories. These are just the people who volunteered to be interviewed. So I've got close to 43, 45 success stories already. And if you look at the comments on my YouTube channel, they're universally positive that people are being benefited by the things I teach on a daily basis. So how to end your chronic pain? Well, first and foremost, you have to understand what causes it in the first place. Now, a lot of people will say, well, of course, Dan, I got a problem with my body. That's what causes it. Not necessarily. So, for anybody who's going, if you tell me that this is in my head, I'm going to get so pissed off. I'm not saying that. What I'm telling you is there's a lot of misinformation out there. There's a lot of misdiagnoses. And brain science and how pain is created absolutely must be factored in. Because chronic pain is much different than acute pain. If you smack your hand with the hammer, ouch, you're going to feel it. You're going to notice it, right? Pain is designed to get our attention. But chronic pain is almost always a mistake. Because the body heals, right? So if the body truly had a problem, an injury, or something wrong with it, generally it heals within a reasonable period of time. Weeks, maybe months. But if you've had pain that's been lasting longer than that, it's very likely your brain patterns have learned to keep it going based on two things, fear and attention. That's not to say your pain is in your head. The pain is real. You feel it in your body. It's just created or kept persistent by something I call the perception of danger, right? So it's really, really important for you to understand one, what causes pain, and then number two, to figure out, does this thing that Dan's talking about that sounds pretty wild and out there, does that apply to me? Most likely it does, if you've got pain for longer than 6 to 12 weeks. Um, but you want to find out. So you go to yourpaintest.com, take the pain test, and see what it says. Because if your score is 29 or above, that means... Your brain is responsible for creating the pain based on its perception of danger and the perpetual fear of the pain itself or movement or body positions or anything like that can be enough perceived danger to keep the symptoms going. So, I really want you to understand I'm not suggesting anybody is crazy, I'm not suggesting anybody is imagining this, not suggesting this is all in your head. The pain is very real. And I know because I had 13 years of it. Chronic back pain and sciatica. Sometimes it was mild, but many times it was wild, flooring me. You know, laying in bed for hours at a time. 
I did continue working, but very often I had to pause, go behind a closed door, and lay on my back to let my back decompress and sink into the floor. I would do that half a dozen to a dozen times a day just to make it through the day. So I understand what chronic pain is like. I was the back pain guy in my neighborhood. Dan, how's your back? Uh, uh, you know, I'm the guy who would make noises, sound effects, the groans and moans as I was getting up and sitting down and climbing in and out of the car. So I experienced it firsthand. And I've been without any chronic pain for 14 years now. So there is a way to end your pain. So if anybody has told you that chronic pain is forever, they're wrong. It's not forever. And i got to move because sun's shining in my eyes. I want to get out of that. Um, yeah, chronic pain is not forever. I'm proof of it. And there's countless people who are proof of it as well. Go look at the success stories on my channel, on the playlist, success stories. Um, and I do coaching. And people are getting better. People who didn't want to live anymore, being in bed rest, sometimes for years, are getting their lives back. It's possible. There is a way to end your chronic pain. Um, but it's much different than you're going to hear from the medical doctor, you know, and the, uh, the mainstream medical world. Because they're not aware of this stuff. They are, I think I heard the, uh, the number is that for a doctor who goes to medical school, they spend a total of nine hours on chronic pain. Nine hours. I don't mean a week or a month or a year. Total for the entirety of medical school. The doctors don't know about this stuff. And because they don't know about it, it's not taught, when they hear about it, they kind of brush it off. But there's a whole community of people who are aware of this and are getting better. So I'm going to mentioned a doctor's name. He figured this stuff out in the 1970s and 80s. His name is Dr. John Sarno. He worked in the New York Institute of Rehabilitation in New York City. And for many decades, this gentleman was responsible for helping people end their chronic pain. Now, he was who eventually helped me get rid of my chronic pain. Not directly, through some books, through some study, I finally was able to accidentally come, up out, come upon some of the concepts that I'm teaching now on a daily basis to both my coaching clients and through these daily videos. And so this is not new stuff. This is not Dan making stuff up. This is created and founded by a medical doctor. And what I've been doing is I lived it for the first 13 years and for the past 14 years, I've remained fascinated by this stuff. I've continued to study it. And now for about six or seven years, I've been coaching people. And literally for uh, about 1,585 days now, in a row, I've been teaching this stuff daily on YouTube and Facebook in these videos. And as a result, I've had the opportunity to interact with tens of thousands of comments on my videos over those 1,580 some odd days in a row of videos. And I've essentially created my own laboratory where my video concepts will get feedback and I learn directly from you what works and what doesn't. If I put out a video topic and it's crickets and silence, I know that that one's probably not that great. And over the years, I hone my message and I learned more from teaching these concepts daily than I did in the prior 20 some odd years of either living with chronic pain or studying it. And so thank you for watching and commenting and sharing with me what's working and what's not working. And if something doesn't make sense, I refine my message and I'm able to explain it more clearly. And as a result, what I think I've done is taken Dr. Sarno's work, refined it, made it more simple to understand, more simple to implement. So if any of this is creating some curiosity for you. Trust that intuition. There is a solution. There is a way out of chronic pain. And I have people from around the world letting me know that they're getting better just by implementing the concepts I'm teaching in these daily free videos. Now, one thing that I've put together, which will help all of you 
gain a much deeper understanding of what causes symptoms, how to determine if it's what's going on with you, and also, uh, most importantly, what to do about it. Like, how do we reverse this process? If perceived danger is what's creating the symptoms, well, how do we turn that off? Well, in my opinion, it's creating safety proactively. It's teaching our brain, our subconscious brain, which is controlling the whole thing, teaching our subconscious brain that there is no actual danger. It's perceived danger, not actual, not a real threat. And just understand that no matter how the pain started, the brain with enough fear and attention can learn to keep those pain signals going on a loop. There's a fear pain loop that continues and can continue for years or decades until we interrupt it. And that's what my job is, is to help you interrupt that. And I give away tons of free content. So what I'm gonna point you to is my fast start playlist where I've probably organized, I don't know, eight to 10 videos with the core concepts that you really wanna you drill on. Watch it over and over again. Watch, take notes, and then start to implement a little bit at a time. By doing that, you're gonna get a deep, deep, deep understanding of what actually creates chronic pain or symptoms. Now look, for anybody who doesn't have pain and has other symptoms and somehow stumbled on this, this stuff applies to so many other symptoms. There's probably a thousand symptoms that are affected by the brain perceiving danger. So drill on this. Watch that fast start playlist over and over again. How do you find it? You go to Pain Free You channel, search that on YouTube, go into the channel, click on playlists, and the very first playlist in there says fast start. Watch those videos in order. Once you're done, start watching them again, and then watch them again, and take notes, and let this stuff sink in, because it's counterintuitive. You might be thinking, ah, this guy Dan, he's full of crap. That's okay, but I'm still getting results with the people who are following these recommendations, learning it, accepting it. And they take it from the intellectual knowledge to a deep knowing that, holy crap, this is what's going on with me. So I'm gonna really encourage everybody to put their disbelief on hold, set aside the skepticism, because I'm sure there's plenty of people right now who are going, ah, I don't know, too good to be true. But I don't believe it is. You know, I've got people with pain for decades many decades, we're getting better by implementing these simple, proven concepts. People are getting better. I did, you can too. So how do you end chronic pain? It's gotta start with education. Gotta start with understanding how this human system works, how the brain, pain, the nervous system, how stress, all of that stuff fits together to create an environment where pain can become persistent and chronic. But by understanding that, you can then figure out and assess, well, does that apply to me? There are some assessments. I've got a getting started page on my website. So painfreeu.com forward slash start. Two assessments that'll help you figure out if this stuff applies to you. Once you've done that, then what we wanna do is recognize there is a way out. There's a cure, there's a solution. There's a way to end your chronic pain or symptoms and then decide that you have what it takes because if other people are getting better, you surely can too. Because if you're capable of learning anything, and I'm sure you have learned a whole bunch of stuff in your lifetime, you're capable of learning how to do this too. Is it hard? I'll say it's not easy, but it's very doable. And with daily guidance, with my daily videos, with a very uh, good core foundation with that fast start playlist, um, you've got pretty much everything you need. Now, if you do want more help, I do have a group coaching program, but that's not what this video is about. Um, this is about really showing you that there is a way to end your chronic pain. If you're interested in more, go to my website, painfreeu.com. Look at the get help and, and poke around. But just understand there is a solution. The free daily videos are getting a lot of people better, even without paying me a dime. And then the Fast Start Checklist, which is also free in the YouTube channel, is also capable of helping you eliminate and end your chronic pain. So don't discount this stuff, ah, this guy's crazy. I'm not, definitely not. The stuff works, 
look at the uh, success stories, read through some of the comments, inevitably universally, universally positive comments from the audience, and many people saying I'm doing so much better. So I hope this helped you understand that there is a cure or a way to end your chronic pain. Don't trust Google when they say, oh, chronic pain can be forever. Excuse me, but bullshit. Way too many people are ending their chronic pain with the concepts I'm teaching that were originally founded by Dr. Sarno, but uh, you know, I've really honed them quite a bit over the past 25 years and mostly the past four years or so since I've been doing these daily videos and having the blessing of talking to so many of you one-on-one -on -one through the comments sections and also through one-on-one -on -one coaching, which I'm not doing anymore, I'm just doing the group coaching, but I interact with so many people every week and I learn so much from you. And as a result, I am extremely confident that if you can learn this stuff, decide that it's for you, and then focus on implementing these strategies of creating safety in your brain, in your mind, in your body, know that you're safe, your brain will turn off these false alarms. So I'm gonna wrap this one up before it gets too, too long, but uh, how to end chronic pain, education, know what causes it. Two, decide that this is what's going on for you. Three, know there's a solution. Four, know that you're capable of it and then implement. And the fast start playlist really walks you through all of that. All right, walks you through all of it. Watch this video over and over again as well, uh, especially if you're skeptical. So I hope this helps and uh, welcome to the solution guys and gals. It's, uh, this stuff works. Anyway, love you all. And uh, as always, I'll see you tomorrow. Take care.